1 News. Hey, good evening. It's good to be with you. I'm Gian Kim reporting from Harvesters, where we're celebrating day two of our Fill the Fridge campaign. Now, we are asking you to donate to KSHB 41 uh, to, so that we can provide fresh produce, things like meats, dairy, uh, vegetables, things like that, those perishable food items, so that families right here in the KC Metro don't go hungry. Now, Harvesters, all week long, we have been highlighting the impact, just the positive impact that they're making in our community. And they won't be able to do any of this without their wonderful volunteers. Just about five, ten minutes ago, we had a small volunteer group come in here, and they're about to start packaging onions. You know, Harvesters provides emergency food assistance to those who need it now, but it's also working to address health outcomes in the long term. They partner with area hospitals and county health departments to do this. This program is called Food Plus. Earlier this week, I talked to University Health and the Clay County Public Health Center to hear from them about the impact that these regular food shipments have for their clients. A couple of little Slim Jims. And here's the We've got two drinks today. Just about every day, Jesse Jasnowski comes to the University Health Food Pantry for a free sack lunch. The cost of groceries have gone up tremendously over the past couple of years, you know, so just a, it's, it's not a whole lot of food, but it's a snack, you know. He's never turned away, and he never leaves hungry. That's a guarantee. Susan Uwati and her staff started this food pantry in 2020 to help patients and families like Jesse's. They started out serving 20 households a day, but now they see over 110. Some patients are asking for toothpaste or a brush or maybe a shampoo, like whatever they need. Patients always walk away with two bags full of food, one containing fresh produce and pre-made lunches, the other with non-perishables. 90% of food and personal hygiene products are donated by harvesters. I had a parents before telling me, you know, I didn't have dinner for my kids, but tonight I'm going to serve them something. That means a lot, you know, for somebody to speak up and tell you that. In addition to providing emergency food assistance, Harvesters is combating the root causes of food insecurity by working with hospitals and health departments through its Food Plus program. Clay County knows poor nutrition is directly linked to chronic illnesses. Ideally, people wouldn't be needing to go to hospitals because we're able to give them things like vaccines and healthy foods or access to different resources to make them healthy in the first place. Harvesters understands public health is all about prevention. It takes a community, though, to make sure their mission to feed the lot continues. What do you think it would mean if this wasn't here for patients who come to University Health, you know? It would, it would be a big loss to the to uh, the patients here. All right, well, you can scan the QR code or head to KSHB.com to donate today. We really hope you will open up your hearts and your wallets for this cause. Just $1 can help provide two meals. So please help us get fresh produce to local families so that they can fill their fridge. Live from Harvesters, Jiang Kim, KSHB 41 News.